So this problem is the limit as x approaches 4, square root of x plus 5 minus 3 over x minus 4. So the first thing you want to do when you see a limit problem is just plug it in and see if it works. And that's called substitution. So you plug in 4. 4 plus 5 is 9. Square root of 9 is 3. 3 minus 3 is 0. And then 4. 4 minus 4 is 0. So it's 0 over 0. Uh, that's not what we want. So um, we try something different. So if you have a square root, you want to try to get rid of it. So how we get rid of square roots? One trick is to multiply both the top and the bottom by the square root. And notice how this is the only thing that changed. We made the minus a plus. So when you have this, um, let's say if it was a plus, then you'd make this a minus. Just use the opposite sign. And why we do this is if you actually distribute all of this out, if you distribute all of this out, um, the, the square roots end up canceling, and that's why we do it. Because all the square roots cancel, and we're left with x plus 5 minus 9. And then since we multiplied the bottom 2, um, uh, we just put that on the denominator here. So then we, we do is 5 minus 9, so we get x minus 4. Now this is helpful because what happens is since x minus 4 is both on the top and the bottom, they both cancel out. And um, try to remember this. Uh, this is an easy mistake. People will cancel this and just leave it as this. Remember, on the top, there's always an invisible 1. Um, is, if this is multiplied by 1, it's still the same thing. So even if you cancel it, you're left with a 1 on top. So that's an easy mistake to watch out for. So it's 1 over square root of x plus 5 plus 3, because both of these cancel out. So next, what you do is you just plug in. Now since everything's done, we use substitution again and see if that works. So we plug in 4 into x. And so we plug in 4, and then that becomes 4 plus 5 is 9, square root of 9. And then we do um, square root of 9 is 3, so it's 1 over 3 plus 3, so it's 1 over 6. So the final answer is 1 over 6. So I hope that helped, and thanks for watching.